So uh, I want to show you uh, a few functionalities of the new Enterprise Command Center, which was just recently announced uh, by the EBS and Suite team. Um, uh, I, there's another video that shows how to work on the ECC administrator and developer. And what I want to show you now are the functionality for one of the uh, command centers, which is the payables command center. So I'm going to click on that. Um, the, there's a role that needs to be assigned and your system administrator will be adding that role into the existing responsibilities. Uh, for the sake of information, I have changed the name of the suppliers by the um, ID. Uh, so you're going to see numbers here instead of names. So what, what I'm doing here, and, and this is you know uh, selecting um, an operating unit. So what you see here on the on the right, on the left, sorry, it's um, you know a, a search uh, and something called refinements. So these refinements are basically the parameters that you're going to be applying to the entire uh, command center. Uh, I'm scrolling down to see all the elements that are showing up here. So again, refinements, I will be able to refine all the information, all the information that is available here. So for example, let's say that I want to refine by the whole name and I can say, okay, whole per CFO, I selected that and it will automatically refresh uh, the entire screen with the information like that, okay? Um, so refinements are good and, and it's a great way to navigate through the information. I can just simply click here and I will be taking out uh, that refinement. Um, if I click on the hamburger here, I will collapse that so I can fully navigate through the information here. Okay. Um, we're going to see that in some things, in some, in some items, I have some hyperlinks or, or the, you know, the ability to do click. So if I click here on ledgers, I'm going to see, you know, how invoice unique numbers are available. This is information only. Uh, if I click here on the information, uh, this will display when was the last time that ran the refresh of uh, Enterprise Command Center. Um, now, as you can see, this is you know uh, uh, called tag, so uh, you know tag uh, uh, view, and and the the bigger the phone, are the more you know bigger quantity I'm going to have for that particular supplier. Uh, if I click on this, okay it will automatically add a refinement uh, for that, you know, you see that supply number and it will add the refinement. So all the information will show for that, you know, uh, supplier automatically. I'm gonna check that out so we can have the information. As you can see how fast this is. Um, now, this is something that, you know, I created, you know, uh, show you how that works and, and you know, we have different type of, of, of displays. Um, as you can see here, you know, uh, I can expand this information, okay? So I'll be maximizing this. I'll take this down to see more information. And actually, if I click here, uh, I will be able to um, um, tailor this you know, with the title, which is the data set that I'm selecting. If, if there's a condition, we see that there's a condition here. So all these available for the users to tailor and, and customize the information here. Um, if I also, you know, uh, this is you know, pretty, pretty uh, amazing in terms of how you can tailor and you can change the information here. Um, uh, again, I'm, I'm selecting different. I can set, set the, the, the chart type, which chart type, if I want to enable how to change that, et cetera, et cetera. Now, Going further down, um, I have this detail insight. And with this detail insight, if I hover the, the mouse on top, I'll see that, well, if I click here, I will refine. So that means it, it, this will be a filter. If I click here, this will also be a filter. But if I click here, I will navigate to the invoice. So what we're saying here is that, you know, the users can actually go and say, well, I refine to see a particular uh, set of invoices. Uh, that are past due, and I can click here and I just go to the invoice directly, okay? If I go further down, we're gonna see uh, an icon here. And if I click on this icon, I'm gonna have the ability to add components as simple as, you know, adding a, you know, a, a chart. I will click on the chart and then I will say where I want to add that chart. 
uh, and then based on that chart I will click on the you know, wheel that you hear and I will say you know this is a test chart uh, and then which which report set you know which data set which component I want to use I can leave this blank and then I'm gonna select you know the, the you know the, the dimensions that I gonna you know be selecting from here. Once I do that, I will scroll further down. I click on save, and I will have right in there you know the the, the chart that that will be displaying based on on the set of the configurations that I did. I click on the X, and I say yes. I want to delete that because I you know didn't show what I was expecting. Um, so this is a quick overview of what you can do with Enterprise Command Center and specifically the Payables Command Center. Where there is a blog post uh, that describes in detail how to do that. And also you can join us at Oracle Open World. There's gonna be a session and also you can visit at our booth uh, for further information. Thanks.